That's what it's called, right? It's beautiful, endless. Feel the warmth of the sun millions of kilometers away on my skin without any atmosphere to stand between us. The upside is it's a truly amazing feeling. The downside is I'm truly about to die. Who would have guessed I'd die floating alone in space? You know, I mean, until now, I've never been any higher up than the top floor of my apartment building, and I only went up there once. My mistake. It all started yesterday. Ordinary day like, like any other. It is un until I got hit on the head. Ouch! Jeez! That was a three-star impact, Wally. Uh, this one needs some work. Three stars? You sure, Ray? R&D insists that this one be a one-star hot hat. One and a half tops. That's some quality hot hats you're testing. You want to trade spots and see for yourself? Three stars. Didn't notice any birds flying around my head, though. Uh, that's something. All right. This one's next. It's a new material R&D wants to try. It says here it's based mostly on... Recycled banana peels and use juice boxes. Saved by the bell, huh? Oh, see you tomorrow, buddy. Hard hat tested. No experience required. It seemed like such a good idea at the time. Ha. This is Gamma 3. We've encountered storm systems too large to go around without delaying landing time. Uh, please advise. Gamma 3? Sean, you told me your name was Jimmy. forget how much jumping is required to get to and from work. Gamma 3 calling base. Please respond. Base, storm now intensifying beyond safety thresholds. Uh, unusually intense lightning activity observed. Attempting to abort. Uh, emergency support requested. Wow! Plane made out of paper can't take the heat, huh? Or even a little rain? I bet those eggheads you thought up a paper airplane was a great idea because it wouldn't be detected by enemy radar. I'm feeling pretty smart right now. Tell me you didn't get him to redesign our parachutes, too. Mayday. Oh, Mayday. The lightning now at level 5 alert. The Omega level package is in danger. Repeat, the Omega level package. Son, I appreciate your concern, but my package is in danger. Spaghetti arm doing sticking out of my head! Okay, stay calm, Ray. Last thing I remember was leaving work and jumping a lot and then getting it on the head. Of course! Uh, the hand growing out of my head and this whole crazy world is all a dream. Nice work, me. If I know my subcon... High five me, Ray. High five me, Ray. I give the best high fives, Ray. High five me instead. Ray, you may think you know high fives, but you haven't experienced a high five until you high five me. Please, please, crazy pin creatures, one at a time. I'll high five Ollie, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> 
Why not, right? Whoa, this arm is awesome! <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm almost sorry, I'll have to wake up from this. <laughs> a cork is a useful thing if you want to keep... Fingers look familiar. Oh, wow, no way! A giant me robot! Okay, so my head is flooded with elephant juice, and inside are a bunch of gears that aren't moving. Which probably means I'm knocked out, and I need to drain the water from my brain. Got it. Help! Help! I can't hold my breath forever! Oh, and there's a creature swimming around in my head. Not sure what to make of that one, honestly. Uh, can you uh, hear me, little guy? Help! Help! A pink elephant pouring water through a hole in my head. I didn't bring my dream symbolism app with me, but I'm guessing this means, hey, a sticker of a tap. I wonder if it's there. I saved you, crazy alien creature thing. Finally dry at last. But the controls don't work. I need power. If only there was a way to get that heart working again. Heart, heart, come here, girl. I miss you. Weird. My girlfriend lives in Robot Me's heart, and she's calling for a dog named Heart. Dreams are crazy. Oh well, at least I'm not back in high school and also naked in this one. Again. <laughs> Oh, hey there, little guy. Uh, you're Hart, Arlene's dream dog, aren't you? How's it going, Hart? <laughs> oh, there's a good girl. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Ahoy, matey! Greetings! I be Redbeard the Scary. I'll have you know that back in my day, I was the most feared pirate on all the seven seas. Bad news, buddy. You're just a figment of my imagination. And this is all a dream. You? Hi. It occurs to me that in real life, skeletons don't talk. Will you do an old sea dog a favor and dream me back to life again? Well, I, I kind of need to lead this dog back to my girlfriend. You've got an arm made of bone, so... I hear you, landlubber. Well, I'd be happy to lend a hand. Oh, <laughs> oh he just realized how well lend a hand worked back there. Heart, come. You came back. What a good girl. Who's a good girl? It's you, Heart. You're the best girl. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm so happy. I love you, Heart. I always knew Eileen was the woman of my dreams. But it's nice to have it confirmed. All the pieces are in place. I was just about to leave. But now I think I'll stay after all. Yes, I'll be able to stay here indefinitely. As long as the host survives. Wait. Wait, wait what? 